was in inexpensive and mechanically reliable. It combined heavy armor with a powerful gun. Early models of the T-34 generally outclassed German tanks. When Germany... anti-tank guns in response. The Soviet Union countered by upgrading to the T-34-85. The Soviet Union and other countries produced tens of thousands of this model during and after the Second World War. The crew area is small compared to Western tanks. In particular, your driver would want to be on the shorter side. I don't know how tall their driver is today, but it's recommended they be five feet, five inches for maximum comfort. Um, the T-34-85 design was in production until 1948 and remained in service in several countries until the mid-1960s. comme l'un des chars les plus efficaces jamais construits. De fabrication soviétique, il est peu coûteux et sa mécanique est 